diamond ships. I'm going to do one box, show you how diamond ships their product. To start off, there's a giant box. There's one giant box. It's pretty thick. It can sustain damage, but it is safer than most, okay? So what we're gonna do here is I'm gonna show you how they ship. They ship in this giant box, okay? It's gonna be not too long of a video, but I wanna show you the differences in the different companies since I did one about Penguin. And I'm sure Penguin's gonna change. This could be helpful for those people that don't ever, don't do this. So here's the giant box, right? You open it up, and as you can see, there are two inner boxes, okay? There's two inner boxes. Now, what they do is, there is this like, see this is in the corner, to protect the corner. I mean, this is uh, another level of protection that they're doing. Anyway, long story short, one big box, two inner boxes, okay? Now these box, this box can be somewhere in the area of 50 pounds, the, the big box. So now we're inside the internal box. There's two of them. These are pretty thick. They're thick boxes. That's what she said. All right. This is diamond. All right, here we go. This is what one of the internal boxes look like to have this. Now remember, this was inside another box. Okay. Now. This can be very interesting, okay? Let's let's start with this. They put this on top. Which is good. This mean this is a ratio, okay? This is a ratio. We'll look at that in a minute cuz I have some beef with that. But look. So, this is the first box. There's two rows of comics. Okay? Two rows of comics and then this divider in the center. This stops the books from moving around inside the box, which is very important for corner row, okay? Now, they just stack them in here. We'll get to that next, all right? We'll get to that next. Now, they've put in a separate box in a Gemini of sorts, which is gonna be Ratios. Now I want to show you something that really bugs me. I don't know if they've changed it, but I'm going to show you. Uh, well, there'll be ratios in the big box, but they, for some reason they put some in here, okay? I mean, most likely it's going to be dynamite books because the paper is so soft and dynamite isn't a good quality paper. All right, I'm going to show you what they put in the Gemini for protection, okay? Hopefully, they did well this time, but they usually don't. Okay, so let's just do this. Okay, now that's not going to work. Anyway, inside the Gemini in the box. Okay, look, I want you to see something. They protected the outside, but look, there's no bubble wrap, okay? in the Gemini, that, those books are gonna move because they're not in a bag and board, which is something that Lunar does. They bag and board their ratios, but the last two orders I got from Lunar, they did not. So these are Jennifer blood ratios, but I want you to see something immediately, okay? Boom. Damage. Now, was that there? When they put it in the box, maybe I'm gonna have to ask for a replacement. And they want, and they, they've been sending me Gemini's, 
with the ratios lately, and I still have to ask for replacements. <laughs> That's really splat. All right, so anyway, damage, okay? That's a ratio, dude. Damage next. Two damages. Damage. Do we have a winner? Chicken dinner? Damage. Of course, this has to do with paper. Do we got one? Minor damage. I won't claim that one. So I got... Four, I don't know, those are probably big ratios, right? Damaged. In a Gemini. I would have rather them just thrown it in there. What's the difference? So, note to Diamond, bubble wrap them. Or, you know what? No, don't, don't bubble wrap them. Put them in a bag and board. Please, just put them in a bag and board. How do you not have bag and board? You're a comp book distributor. Okay. I'm not trying to be too harsh, but that's just the way it is. It's ridiculous. I, get, I order a shitload and they get damage ratios. Okay, now, back to this. I'm only going to unbox one box, okay? So the big box and the two boxes. Here's the books. I explained how they have this in the center to stop it from moving. And this is inside another box, okay? So let's get this out. I can't, now I gotta go through it all, this check on damages, right? And there will be damages. The Jennifer Bud cosplay is pretty cool. Oh man, the hot book of the week. You guys are hoping for some high grade stuff. Minor corner, everything else is fine. That's a 9.6. You guys are gonna be happy. There's your Tony Fleece Red Sonia's, right? I ordered over a hundred of those because you guys are insane. Ooh, that cover's sick. That just Jennifer Buds are sick, right? Okay, now. I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but once I get through all this, and I'm not doing it live, okay, I see a damage already. Look, it's still, it avoids corner rubs, which is kind of the main issue, and packing that I'm trying to teach here, trying to help. Um, unfortunately, a lot of these books, diamond in particular, their paper is, or not diamond, dynamite, their paper is horrible. Okay, so it's gonna get, I mean, I put on my site near mint minus or better. There's nothing we can do about their damn paper. Unless, well, they have done some cardstock, which is nice. Look, there's the FOC ratios, right, in the box. This is in better condition, not in a Gemini, than when they put in a Gemini. And this is a ratio, okay? So you know what? Just don't put them in the damn Gemini because you're going to damage them. Okay. So I'm just showing you how they're. Oh, these are the big dogs. These are the big ones. Oh, mama. Oh, mama. Now, of course, I will have shorts. It never fails that I get some shorts. The only problem is getting them back. Oh, look at this. Look. Those are, those are the fleece ratios that I got, right? Those are completely damaged. That really sucks, <laughs> okay? That really sucks. Thank God they're not your guys's. But they could have been, but you know. Okay, so then it comes with an invoice. Okay, now I have a couple more boxes. I'm gonna only open the two that were inside the main box, okay? But 
let's just do a recap on the first box. The honest to God's truth is it's almost impossible to avoid damages, okay? But if you want to avoid corner rubs, blah, 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 you need to put some space in there. Now, like I said, these are my Jennifer blood ratios that were in a Gemini that are all damaged, which really sucks. I haven't looked through all these books yet. I'm just pulling them out, but I've already got three pretty bad. I mean, that, that's damage. That on, on the hottest book of the week, maybe. Right? How fun. Doesn't matter because, I mean, it does matter, but we have to... There has to be a limit from our expectations to what they can give us. And I understand that. But this is also a learning video for Penguin. I hope that they see, look, yeah, you're gonna have damages, but you can protect your books better than how you shipped. And this is a good example of how. When I get my lunar shipment in, I will do a lunar unboxing too, because I have to be fair to all companies and show how they ship, okay? It's just the way it has to be. So, here's, here's number two. As I said, there is a little movement. Now they also, oh man. Actually, I'm gonna show you both boxes. I'm gonna show you both. Cause my diamond order isn't as big anymore because now Marvel's Penguin and uh, DC is a Lunar, right? So. I've got, that's another problem here. I have to do three unboxings a week, which means I can never take a break, okay? I can never take a break. I have this YouTube channel, and it's suffering because I have a store now. This is my own fault, but I wanna offer you guys everything I can. That's what I do. So, I'm just pulling everything out. I will go through it all later. Oh, here's the dark hold books that got pushed that people are waiting on. Excited for that. <clears throat> but I want you to see again how they pack. Big box. Two of these go in there. There is a center thing in the middle to separate the comics and to kind of stop movement, right? Heavy. Man, I'm really frustrated about that initial damage. I really want to show you this next box though because you have to see something. I think it's important to see. So let me just get it all out. That's what she said. Look at. That's just without, I mean, I have to go through all these, so hopefully it's not as that bad, right? All right, let me get this out of this. <clears throat> all right, I want to show you this other box. And there's a reason why I want to show it to you. Look at this. This covers dope ratio. Look at that. I can do, right? What can I do? I hope I can get replacements. Let's show you this. Wait, let me do this real fast. I don't want to show you everything. I'll show you this last box and why I'm showing it to you. video super long. Of course the penguin one was a little bit more 
detail because it was the first shipment. But this is okay. So this box, the reason I'm showing you this is because this box is lighter, which they did something that I'm not happy with. I already know. See, two boxes inside the big box. It per, it does save for some damages. Okay. Here's. Here's a problem that I don't like. Ready? Okay. So they don't have an answer to small shipments. So this is their answer. Shove this in there. Did you see that? Look. They tried, but why not combine this with that? Right? So let's see what they did. Let's see what's in here. Now we could get lucky. I've got some replacements in here. But you see how it just kind of fell? Look what we got in this box that's so slippery and this ratio actually survived. <laughs> Amazing. Now to give you an example. Last week was uh, last week was gun honey, right? I had 13 1 in 25 variants. They were all damaged. I mean, what am I supposed to do about that? Yeah, these are ratios. This whole box is almost complete the ratios, but you saw how it was filled. Let me show you the other box. Retailer incentive on the bottom. Still, it's okay. Now, why is it okay? Because partially, I mean, they're not all okay. This is thick. These are thick walls. That's what she said. And they're separate. Not a lot of movement inside, except for this box, of course. And this next box. Now, look, I'm... I... I appreciate diamond okay they try to get me replacements and stuff things have been real hectic for them but I things like this piss me off I just look why did they send me dude both boxes could have gone in one box and still been half full right but they decided to send me a giant box and make me pay a shitload of shipping. That's what this problem is here. That's a problem. How many, dude? Oh shit! Can't show you that one. Zombie trap. You guys, there are. 20 comics in that box. There was 20 comics in this huge box. And probably 30 in the other. That's a waste. Of course, I reuse these boxes. But that's how it works, guys. That's how diamond ships. Now, I've already... I've already uh, I did the penguin one. I already threw away the penguin boxes, so I can't compare. But let's just say those boxes are way better. That's where they have to get. That's where I want them to get. But that's how penguin ships, um, or not penguin, diamond. Um, I have to go through all the um, damages now, which could be a lot. 
I guess when I'm done in about an hour or two, come back to this video, go to the video comments, and I will pin the amount of damages that I got. So you know, that's the only way I can do this because this is live. So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick unboxing video and I'll do Lunar next, so I'm fair to all three companies. And thanks again for watching. See you later.